Hey guys, it's your girl Rashida with another episode of Miss Goody's Kitchen. And I'm so excited today because we're making Jamaican cornmeal porridge. It's one of my favorite breakfast meals. I make it as much as I can, but I usually eat it on a Sunday. It's like a comfort meal for myself. Like I really, really love it. Um, it's something that I was taught how to make by Miss Goodies herself, my mother. So now I'm going to show you guys how to make it. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So I want to get up close and personal to show you guys how to make this porridge, um, you know, correctly. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my allspice or whatever you guys call it, pimento seed. I'm going to take, um, I have like four or five of them, and I'm just going to smash it. So I smashed it with my knife. And then after I smash it, I'm going to take it and I'm going to put it inside of the milk just like that okay so after that um, you can either use a cinnamon stick or a ground cinnamon I had cinnamon stick I don't know where I put it <laughs> so I'm using the ground cinnamon which is just as, is just as effective promise you and it smells delicious in here already seriously so put some of that in there then you're gonna mix this Make sure your fire is on low because one, the cornmeal will pop you. Once it starts boiling, two, the bottom of the pot will start to burn from the milk. All right. Then I'm going to add some nutmeg. And I'm going to mix that up as well on my cinnamon sticks. So I'm just gonna take that, bake it in half, you can put that in there, like that, okay? So once that's in there, and it's in there, you can smell it. This smells like bacon right now. It's like not bacon, but like bacon, like you're baking something, like a pie. All right, it's delicious. It smells really good already. So now, I what I did was I put my cornmeal inside of like, uh, cup, whatever cup you have, and I, and I added water to it. So what I did here was I took cornmeal, I took cornmeal, I put it in a cup, and I added water to it. Okay, and I had that, I was mixing this around probably for like two minutes, let it sit there and soak. This is going to stop you from getting lumps when you make your, your porridge, because you don't want lumps inside your porridge, all right? So um, now you can slowly start to add your cornmeal and water mixture in there. All right, and then as soon as you do that, you're gonna start mixing. All right. Okay. So now, as soon as I have put, you put that in, this is a very time sensitive dish. You have to start mixing usually you want to use a whisk guess what i did i forgot my whisk so i'm gonna use a fork but this is for you guys who don't have a whisk just use a fork and the reason why you're going to do this is because you're going to see it's going to start to thicken i'm going to put my fire up a little bit it's going to start to thicken and once it starts to thicken you don't want lumps in there so just take your time and mix it just like that. You hear that mixing mo um, motion? So you can scrape the sides. Make sure the cornmeal is not clogging up on you. Mix in both directions. If you want, at this point, you could take out the pimento seeds. I'm going to leave it in there because it adds more flavor. And I'm used to eating porridge with that in there so it's fine for me but if you want to take it out you can it's fine okay so now you can see that our porridge is starting to thicken already and I'm mixing it mixing it mixing it you see that perfect okay so you just want to keep mixing it and make sure the, the fire now is going to be on the low that that's perfect because when it gets to the consistency that we wanted to we're going to add our vanilla and we're going to add our condensed milk 
Look at this. Poor Liz, I'm so excited. This is it. This is how you do it, guys. So now, now I'm going to add in my sweetened condensed milk. And this, you know how we do it from Jamaica. You blow into this pot, but I'm not going to do that on camera. I'm going to do it off camera. But add it in and um, basically add it in until it gets to your sweet, like however, how sweet you want it to be, that's how much you add. So keep tasting it, tasting it. And then when it's sweet enough for you, that's when you know that it's good. Hey guys, so here's the finished product of my Jamaican cornmeal porridge. So what I did was I continued to sweeten it with my condensed milk. And if you want, you can add some white sugar, you can add some honey. So this is a great dish for you to try on a Sunday morning or any morning. And I like to enjoy it with my tea and I like to work on my blog and things like that. So you guys know what to do. Comment, like, subscribe, and visit MissGoodiesKitchen.com for the full written recipes. I see you guys next time. Thank you.